Hey bro, I just thought I'd show you my rocket stove I made. I started with this tree, cut off a stump, and then I took the chainsaw and I cut little grooves in the bottom, and then I cut an access in the side. And then when you stand her up, you have a rocket stove with venturis on the bottom for air and a feed tube. So I'm going to try and start it up, see how kind of see how hot she gets. See if I can boil some water just for shits and giggles. Talk to you in a little bit. Well, got my pot on. And uh, the fire is really going good. I haven't added any more sticks or anything to it. It's just burning the inside of the log and rut remains of the few sticks I stuck in there to begin with. I just put the pot on, but she sounds like she's sizzling already. I might have to check it. Sounds good. Hotter than a popcorn fart, though. Hope I don't melt my pot. I don't think as much as it smokes, you'd want to cook chicken on there, unless you want to smoke chicken. <laughs> but, well, I'll let this go for a while until she gets warm and make me some soup. Talk to you later. Have a great day. Well, disappointment. No soup. The uh, pot got to boiling real quick, about two minutes, but uh, when I went to pull it off, uh, I got hit in the face with a bunch of flames and pot dumped on the ground, so <laughs> no soup. <laughs> but the rocket stove is uh, it's going gangbusters. It uh, ran out of kindling, it's just burning on the inside of itself now. see how people in uh, Europe and stuff are using these kind of stoves to melt uh, aluminum and steel and lead. It's uh, pretty hot in the top of that thing. I wish I had a temperature gauge I could shoot at it. But all the fire is concentrated right into that center. And uh, I'll bet you it's probably... 17, 1800 degrees at least right now. Oh well. So much for soup there. I'll uh, go to the propane stove. <laughs> you take care. We love you. Don't work too hard.